Hi everyone, I'm Rosamund Pike. I read English at Wadham from 1997 to 2001. Uh, a very mean-spirited uh, adult, I didn't consider myself an adult at the time, said to me when I got into Wadham, oh, you're going to Oxford, what college are you going to? And I said, Wadham. And he said, oh, wadham -o. And I looked very puzzled and he said, you don't get it. I said, no. He said, oh, that's what people say when you say you're going to Wadham, because as soon as you answer Wadham, they say, oh. He didn't mean it as a compliment, but I was intrigued. I thought, OK, so what is it about this college that unsettles people enough for them to need to make a joke about it? And a not very good one at that. And I think it's the thing that's always unsettled people about Wadham, is that it thinks differently as a college. It's been a college that has never shied away from owning that Oxford can make people uncomfortable. It was always the college that didn't conform, that defied tradition while still upholding it, that was always questioning, can we do better? Can we think differently? Is this the only recipe? And I think it's always shown the Oxford community that intelligence comes in all kinds of different packages. I think other colleges think they show this, but I think Wadham is the one that truly does. Because they've always made a concerted effort to look for intelligence beneath the superficial show of it. And that is why I am Wadham proud. I'd encourage you all to think back on your time and wonder whether your lives now have something to do with that time. And if your answer to that question is yes, then take the figure that's in your mind and write a check, or even better still, take the figure that's in your mind and double it and then write the check.